Suppose the world's current oil reserves is 2,400 billion barrels. Assume the total reserve is decreasing by 18 billion barrels of oil each year. Answer the following questions. Give a linear equation for the total remaining oil reserves R in billions of barrels in terms of T, the number of years. Notice how we're starting with 2,400 billion barrels of oil, but it is decreasing at a rate of 18 billion barrels per year. So the equation would be big R, or the number of billion barrels of oil, is going to be equal to the starting amount of 2,400 billion barrels. And then since it's decreasing by 18 billion barrels a year, it would be minus 18 times T, where T is the number of years. The next question wants us to determine the total oil reserves in 15 years which means we know that T is going to be equal to 15. So using our equation from the first part, we can substitute 15 for T and answer this question. So we'll have R equals 2,400 minus 18 times 15. We'll go ahead and use the calculator here. Of 2,400 minus 18 times 15. So we have 2,130, which means after 15 years, the oil reserve is 2,130 billion barrels. And for the last question, it says, if no other oil is deposited into the reserves, and demand stays constant, how long will it take to deplete the world's oil supply? Well, if the oil supply is depleted, that means the number of barrels in reserve would be zero. So they're telling us to solve for T when R is equal to zero. So using this equation here, we'd have zero equals 2,400 minus 18T. So to solve for T, we'll add 18T to both sides of the equation. This would be zero, so we'd have 18t equals 2,400. We divide both sides by 18 to solve for t. So we'd have t equals this quotient, 2,400 divided by 18. We have 133.3 repeating. Notice how the directions do ask us to round to two decimal places. So in this situation, the oil reserves would be depleted after approximately 133.33 years. Okay, I hope you found this helpful.